Let's try again. How you doing, Shadow? Thank you for the follow, man. The year is 1990X. The town is asleep. RNG3 is off. On it, a small RNG3 trigger town in Eagleland. In one bed sleeps the savior. Little does he know that as long as he moves on a very specific path, he will save the world. Man, I'm having the dumbest little issues with movement tonight. Like, if I pop in my SD to SNES, I will nail it first try. It's the dumbest thing. I think Crescendo's right. I think I'm just pressuring myself too much. And I'm just overthinking things. I need to just play. That's a good point. Like right here, you turn up, up, and then diagonal through the flowers. And then the rest of this is pretty straightforward. You just don't want to hit any buttons. And do not get shush copped. I've already gotten shush copped twice tonight. It's funny because in practice, I was getting pokey super early. And then in runs, I kept a. Uh, Getting shush cop. Don't forget to pour out your 40 for dead ho homie Buzz Buzz. He's still alive right now. He's not gonna die in this run. It's the Buzz Buzz lives minute. RNG3 trigger town, exactly. Yeah, RNG3 turns on after I leave with Pokey. And that's like... The areas that have RNG3, for, to my understanding, are the parts where your movement really matters. Like, right here, I could stop. And it wouldn't change the RNG. But here... Oh, that's RNG1 and 2. I'm sorry. I was overthinking it. But RNG3, if I'm not mistaken, it's every 64 pixels whenever it's on. No, uh, it's hard to manipulate through uh, winners because of Bubble Monkey. I don't know if it's been figured out, but as far as I know, most of the top runners stop manipulating after Graveyard. Stuck to the dog.
That's fine. Yeah, I know that uh, I've seen that with Sarian when he does uh, the manip and he messes it up. He can fix it. For me, right at this point, if I mess it up, it's it would be a Hail Mary. I wouldn't know what I was doing. <laughs> like, I wouldn't know if I was behind or ahead. I would just be like, oh, okay. Is that because of the Skyrunner? I'm gonna doubt A down B. at you because those raindrops are probably RNG no not anymore I'll be done with my goal for the trials and I'll be able to start the next game which is AVGN adventures but I am gonna keep running this game at least till sub 4 trying to get you to get sub four man I'm just trying to encourage you is that that's good to know looking for dad and mom to be facing up down in opposite directions I think dad faces down mom faces up I probably need to work on my mashing a little bit. See, if, if I had L mapped to like X, <laughs> this was an emulator, I would map L to X and I would be in there. Because I'm really good at mashing uh, face buttons. But the L button to me is just a weird movement. What's up, Tulip? Think that counted? That didn't feel like a glide. That felt like more like a bump.
We got it. Oh yeah, <laughs> sorry. I was I was thinking about what to do. I guess maybe I should talk it out. So here we're gonna auto fight, and then after the smash, we're gonna mash. Okay, here we go. Can I get through here? I'm gonna hold down left until I'm over the ME, then I'm gonna go down. Then I'm gonna go down around the top arcade machines and then directly right. Straight down, straight right. He went left! Okay, now let's see what Frank does. We're in there. Cause he went up down, so that's an A down B. And then it's A down B in here. Oh, I got you. So that's a way to know what you're gonna get. And then it's an A B uh, after here. Here's the other spot where I always drop them a nip. Excuse me. Oh, we're in there. Come on, baby. Nope, nope, this is fine. This is fine. Some prime earthbound subbing. J Dirk, thank you for five months in a row. <sighs> What's up, D Rock? How you doing, sir? My heart is pounding. <laughs> My heart is pounding, dude. A-B-A-A. -A. Never gotten this far with the manip. Into the PSI menu twice, then center of sparkling spot.
hungry! Hype! My heart is freaking pounding, dude. Okay. <sighs> My heart is pounding, dude. I haven't, I haven't been this nervous since I was on sub 28 pace in Zelda, man. Oh, I'm shaking. <laughs> It's A down B. Whoa, D pad. Wait, where's the ants? What did I do wrong? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we'll just we'll just drop them a nip. We'll just keep going. That's still not bad. I need to go buy protective gear. I wonder what I did wrong. Now the question is, can I survive the cop fight on this level or do I need to level up once? And the answer is we're going to find out. I'm going to beat the uh, Mr. Baseball cap. Oh, did I, that, when my D-pad screwed up? That's because I was pressing it too hard. Oh, well. Still, I'm pretty happy with that. I probably should have just death warped. Oh well. Now I just gotta get through the rest of the game. That makes me a lot less nervous. So let's go get the Mr. Baseball cap. Oh, that's right. And that's what the whole point of that manip is to get the butterfly. I don't think I got that burger. Oh, I didn't, I didn't equip it. Okay, so I can afford four burgers, I think. And I still have a dollar for the, uh... Oh, no! My math was off. That's fine. Okay, so when I save in Tucson, we'll have to withdraw whatever I get from here. So we'll pretend I got it. We'll go down here. Boop. Pronzo! What's up, dude? Did I even equip the stuff? I didn't even equip the stuff, did I? I think everything's right. I think I'm okay. Yeah, we're fine. Nice! What manip? What? Who needs a manip? Kappa. <laughs> I do need to heal, though. Please stop chopping me. This is not good. I need a light. I need to level up. I 
might have healed twice in a row. It's always the third cop. It's always the third cop, dude. And I still haven't leveled up. I'm tempted to rock him. Oh, this is bad. <sighs> what do you do here, Harry? Do I rock and rock it and hope I get lucky? Yolo. <laughs> Yolo, baby, let's go. <laughs> yes, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I just got so lucky, dude! <laughs> oh my god, I just got so lucky! What's up, Osbo? How you been, man? Oh, I just got so lucky! I can't believe I'm alive! I'm super underleveled and I'm half dead, but we're alive. I forgot the movements there, but that's fine. I just started learning that right before the stream. Oh, I'm sorry to hear you're sick, dude. Hopefully you feel better. It's been going around, man. My brother's sick, and I'm not feeling great. I feel like I'm starting to come down with something. I'm... I probably... am okay. Your mushroom. There isn't much room to get around him. Yo, Sarium, thank you for the host. My dude, I had I had the manip all the way through the ant, and then I, I screwed up my inputs coming out of uh giant step and dropped it, dude. How you doing, man? Let's take out 10 bucks. Oh, you know what? No, no, I need more money than that. I don't even know if I have enough. <laughs> Let's just go. I'm probably gonna have to get the ATM in uh, Peaceful Rest, but whatever. Yeah, and I started learning all the way to... I started learning up till... Uh... Tucson. I still have a lot of work to do. I'm probably... I guess that's about halfway with what I've learned so far. And I watched your video all the way through. Nice. I'm hoping to be doing full minute runs, uh... by next weekend. That's my hope, anyways. All right, boober flies. I need some boober flies. Yeah, easily. Before I started doing the manip, I was rarely more than 30 seconds green, leaving uh, strong. So even with the little snafus I've had in this run. I'm sorry to hear that. Plasma sig, dude, that sucks. I'm sorry, the husbo. Hopefully everyone in your family feels better soon. No boober fly. Lots of spawns, but no boober flies. God, I can't wait till this cave is free. As you can see, it's far from free at the moment.
How you doing tonight, Sarium? Hopefully you're doing well. Did you stream at all tonight? Oh, come on, UFO. Get out of here. Liked in the video when the two little sprouts showed up there. You were like, those guys are there to tell you not to keep going up. I laughed. I thought that was funny. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Get away from me. Really? Come on, game! Oh my goodness. Ugh! The game knows, dude. The game knows. It's like, here, you're this far ahead, you finally nailed the nip. Let's just uh, give you a bunch of sprouts. This is how all your boogie runs go? Yeah. Is boogie runs, there are no manip? Like you're not allowed to do the manip for boogie? Ah, I got you. So this will not be a PB then. I'm glad, because I totally was going to submit this as a boogie percent PB. Come on, game. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I need a butterfly. Thank you. I did not need four mushrooms, but a butterfly is nice. I'm telling you it is. It, it's like the game knows, man. Oh, two butterflies. Okay. I mean, I know I'm a newer runner, but this is like some of the most spawns I've ever seen. And look at the time save. I'm still potentially... Okay, maybe not, because I keep getting trolled. I'm, I might not lose time here. Maybe. I don't know. I have no idea, because that was horrible. Yeah, I'll still lose time, but... Oh, is it? I, s I know the Manip does that, so I, I figured that was the best path, but maybe that's just because of all the NPCs, I'm guessing. All the NPCs in Berglund Park. is very alive as long as I don't do any major derps PB's there I mean I still have like 15 minutes of time saves ahead this could easily PB by 20 minutes I was kind of hoping to nail the manip all the way through uh, on it at least uh -oh, what do we got going on somebody got the tenders I didn't even see what happened see spawns in front of the pencil. Yo, D-Rock. Uh, is everything okay, man? You're timing out a bunch of people. If you're here, sorry, Sirium. I don't know what's going on. Yo, D-Rock, is everything all right? Okay, never mind. My bad. Oh, that's bullshit. <laughs> oh, 
I didn't know what was going on. Okay, I, I get it now. I thought you were like, your cat was getting on your mouse or something. I need a booper fly. Okay. <laughs> I need another butterfly now. I could do the cup of life noodle strat. I just don't know if it's worth doing since I'm doing no manip here. It's probably stupid. Can I please stop getting spawns for five seconds? Please. Good lord. Yeah. I like it. I like it. The, the Earthbound community is really dope. I, I, one of the biggest reasons why I'm really enjoying running this game. It's like, it reminds me a lot of the Zelda 1 community. It's very tight-knit. And I love it. Uh-oh. Nope, 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 nope. Oh god, this is bad. Please. Oh my god. We're going for it. No. Snake. You gotta be kidding me, dude. <laughs> this is so bad. What is going on, dude? Oh, and the snake is uh, aggro again. The snake is aggro again, dude. They're both. Are they both aggro? Oh, they're instant win. I didn't even think about that. It's all good. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna have to get money out. I'll have to get money out before I go, uh, before I go revive Paula. The last time I did a run, I got, like, 12 cultists in this cave. No crow party, let's go. The snakes are clones of big boots. <laughs> just kick butt like I know you can. She just told me to kick ass. Kick ass. I'm glad I got those extra boober flies in Happy Happy or in uh, Peaceful Valley. The crow's in the middle. We're on RNG, Kappa. Ew. Oh no! Just rocking again. Yeah, I forgot the B time. It dies on too. <laughs> Fucking RNG, dude. Hit the crow. He's lost 25 matches in a row on Smash. Holy crap. Alright. Are we gonna get door block lady? I do that every time. Don't go around the left. Left is bad. Stay away from that door lady. Nice. Nice uh, talk. I should probably get the croissant. No, I shopped before. Croissant. Excuse me. Damn, I probably should heal, huh? What? 
Oh my god. Rip. <laughs> okay, well, now we're not healing for sure. Man, my offense sucks. And I don't have any healing items. So we're gonna get the lucky double lightning bolt. I have one rock and no heals. Okay, that's good. Oh, that's good. Okay, I have to. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> what is going on? Why am I getting such good luck in the battles and yet my spawns are so bad? Like, why can't I just get all good spawns and be super happy? So I've got one refreshing herb. And I don't think I have... Sorry, refreshing herb. I don't know if I have any healing items. <laughs> I'm not very good at Smash. I like to play Smash, but I'm terrible at it. Like, I would say I'm better than, like, the average gamer, but the average gamer isn't somebody who's on Twitch. Where am I going? I can wait to learn this area. No, I was just thinking about what's in my inventory. I think the only thing I have is the skip sandwich, which is good. Oh, there's a crow party. Get in there. So I'll be grabbing the bitch bear. If I walk back, I'll have two bears. This is true. I actually have walked back before when I had too much HP on Ness. I think I finished the fight. I had to life up because I was out of healing items. And, um... So I decided to walk back because the time before I had, like, the worst death warp. Uh-oh. Mole. Mole. Good. Oh gosh, mole. Good, dummy. I hope I kill him. I hope I kill him. And of course, I guts it out. Yeah, basically what they said. Yeah, it wasn't as bad as it looked like it was going to be. Yeah, my way, strong man. I'll see you soon, buddy. I'm not your buddy, friend. I'm not your friend, yeah. I'm not your guy, pal. Sour, please. Yeah, man! The reggae hospital tunes, man! I love that song.
Don't forget, bitch bear. I suppose the exit mouse would be good for maybe if you were trying to do uh, Trillion Age Sprout early. Ooh, I almost went the wrong way. God, it's a cop! I'm innocent! <laughs> but yeah, the manip is so legit. Nice! GG, sir. Dude, the manip is so legit, and now that I'm getting the hang of it, I'm just so much happier. It's like, it might take longer to get a run, but I'm so much happier than I am with grinding out attempts for four hours. Oh, I thought I got the freaking photo trigger. I was like, what the hell? I stopped moving for some reason. Like, eventually I'd like to maybe learn it through the, the graveyard, but I think if I could get it through Mondo Mole, um, that would be pretty dope. What's up, Tao? My chat does have a name. It's the Puppy Pound. Yeah, that's the one thing, is that having fire from Boogie. Yeah, it's, um... It's lag that occurs when there's too many sprites on screen, Agent. That's pretty much a fault of the Super Nintendo. The Super Nintendo is a very powerful console for its day, but Nintendo cheaped out with the processor, and it's not a very fast CPU in there. Why am I mashing? Um... <clears throat> That's why you see, like, a lot of games are on both platforms, like the Sega Genesis and the Super Nintendo, or, like, the Turbo Graphics. Um, like, shooters, like shmups, had a lot of slowdown. Like, R-Type was not a very good version on uh, Super Nintendo. <clears throat> so for all the benefits that the Super Nintendo had over Genesis, the, uh, the CPU was the biggest weakness that the console had, besides storage capacity, I suppose, which wasn't really a big deal when the Super Nintendo came out. It was more of a big deal with, uh, the N64. Let's go. Look at the time saves I could have had in Apple Kid and Car Painter, just because of bad RNG. That's just on non-manip, too. Which is just crazy to think about how much time I could eventually save. I don't have long enough hair to do it. <laughs> I need longer hair so I can headbang properly. I wouldn't mind trying that. I wonder if that would work. I don't think it would work with PS2 or uh, 
what other game consoles had our uh, capacities for a hard drive? I think just PS2 and Xbox for like the, that generation. Because I know the Wii, you can use a USB hard drive. And obviously the PS3 and Xbox 360 had hard drives. But um, like I, I've been interested in doing the uh, soft mod for the PS2 to install a hard drive, but you have to use like an old SATA drive. And only certain ones worked, so it's like hard to find one with like enough capacity to actually put games on it. You can put like a couple. <clears throat> Alright, James, if you're gonna take an encounter, equip your stuff. James? James? If you're gonna take an encounter, equip your stuff. How about we just don't take an encounter? That'd be sweet. Nope. Nope. No ninja fly! I got scared. Ninja fly scared me. Have fire. <laughs> yeah, I'm really sad that Nintendo shut the Wii Shop down. Nintendo had an opportunity to really make a statement towards game developers and game manufacturers and stuff with the current state of online and digital gaming. And the new announcement for the Google console that's coming out. What's going to happen when Google decides that it's no longer in their best interests to keep those servers up for their new get for the games that you buy? But you just lose your your games; they're just gone. So Google Google announced a new console that's going to be streaming only. There's going to be no downloadable games. There's going to be no cartridges, no discs, no cards. You stream all of the games from the cloud. It's not so much if they keep selling it, but if I pay $50 for a game, I expect to own it. I don't expect it to be a license. So, what are they going to do? And I guess what I was getting at is Nintendo, at least when you bought games on the Virtual Console, um, you still had access to them. Like, if you bought a game on the Virtual Console, you could still play it. Um... But they could have kept the Virtual Console active. I'm sure it doesn't cost them tremendously more money than it. I mean, it, you could have integrated it with the servers you use for the Wii U and the Switch and the 3DS, technically. I don't know why they couldn't. I mean, granted, yeah, eventually people aren't going to use their Wiis anymore. I haven't touched my Wii. Oh, God, that sounds so bad. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Manka S. <laughs> TOS indeed. <laughs> As I was trying to say, I haven't played with my Wii <laughs> in a long time. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, I'm dying. I can't breathe. Uh, oh. <laughs> Wii gaming console. The, the Nintendo Wii. <laughs> oh, man. I can't breathe. <laughs> I can't breathe. Oh. Serious! Serious! Okay, we gotta get serious. It's a serious speed run, you guys. Serious speed run. Oh my god, I'm dizzy. 
Oh. <laughs> I'm so thrown off. Okay. Um, I forgot what we were saying. See, talking about playing with my Wii got me all distracted. What is that? Yo, J Derg! <laughs> Thank you for the phrasing, my friend. Phrasing. Continue with the poor phrasing, 100 bits. I appreciate it, sir. <laughs> the Wii Wii? <laughs> they might as well have. The Wii U is much better. It sounds like a damn police siren. I love the Wii U. Although, I will say... Thank you, Grample. Ever since Nintendo started porting all the really good uh, games from the Wii U to the Switch, the Wii U isn't nearly as good as it was, but the Wii U has a good library. It really does. The only thing it was really missing was like a marquee Mario game. I mean, Mario Bros. Wii U or whatever isn't very good. Oh, come on, Crow. I mean, it's good, but it's not a marquee Mario game like Odyssey. But yeah, Wii U uses the virtual console as well, and what's gonna happen when they shut that down? I hope they port Wind Waker HD and uh, Twilight Princess HD to the uh, Switch. I hope so. I also hope they do a Skyward Sword HD. And I hope when they do Skyward Sword HD, I think they will. I do think they will. Before the end of the Wii, uh, the Switch's life cycle, they'll do a Skyward Sword HD. And when they do... MS Paint Beast! My bad! My bad! Hold the, hold the conversation! I need some MS Paint Beasts in chat, yo. Hook me up, guys. I need this. I need this! And if you've got other emotes that are beasts, can I get them? What's up, Hex? Oh no, dude! I'm sure they can. They sell new lasers for the Wii U, dude. My jaw hurts from laughing. That's how much I was laughing earlier. That's a beautiful sight. Look at those. Look at those purple Tessie hype going on in chat right now. A couple other uh, Nessies in, in chat. I like it. I like it. Grandpa got me. I don't even know what that is. What is that? Angry. I like it. I like it, you guys. You guys kick butt. <laughs> no, but uh, if they do port Skyward Sword HD to the to the Switch, I hope they allow you to use the 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 Joy-Con for a motion controller because the Joy Cons are really good. But also, I hope that they integrate just regular play because, like, how are you supposed to do it when you're playing it in portable mode? You know what I mean? Like, I hope that they. Do it right. They need to add controller support. But, I mean, even if it's only Joy-Con and on your TV, I think that'd be, uh, that'd be fine. I'd be fine with that. <clears throat> I do like that Nintendo and Microsoft might be working together. Not so much because I like Microsoft. Like, screw Microsoft. But, we're getting Cuphead on the Switch because I don't have an Xbox One. So I'm pretty hyped about that. I don't know how to skip that guy. Damn it, Bubble Monkey. No. Don't do it. All right, we should be in there. <clears throat> but we're going to we're going to get possibly what I think the console landscape is going to eventually have to have, and that is all of the console manufacturers working together. I don't think I get Duck Skip. It's fine. We'll just fight the duck. He's going to try his hardest. He's trying his best, you guys. Look at him. Wow, he actually hit me. The duck took his steroids. Oh, God! The duck took his steroids. This is bad. I'm going for it. I wasn't healing on the duck. Screw that. Thank you, Tank Tanks. How you doing, man?
Wait, what? I thought you could glide on these. Come on, Bubble Monkey. Ah, I need to practice that. Stop it. Stop it. We're going to lose time here at best. Don't call for help. Okay, whatever. We're going to lose some time, but at least we got through. I guess not. But I think it'd be pretty sweet to eventually see the console manufacturers at least working together. Do I dare? No. Nope. No, get it. God damn it, Bubble Monkey! It's just sludge. It's fine. Tons of experience points, yay for that. Maybe I'll get lucky and this will all be despawned. Nope, I screwed up. I'm gonna take the encounter. Bubble monkey! God damn it! It's alright, it's just slugs. This is fine. I mean, I guess I'm leveling up, so there's that. Man, my stutter steps are bad today. Well, that was really good. Okay! I ain't even mad! Even with those encounters, that wasn't that bad, dude. I will take that. That's one thing I love about the Switch. They're still physical. I mean, PS4 is still pretty physical, too. But Microsoft straight up doesn't want physical at all. No, come down. I think I can get away with that. Okay. I mean, it makes sense, but for me as a play as a gamer, even with modern consoles, I hate having to, to manage a hard drive. I like to have a lot of games. I like to have options. So for me, having the actual cartridge or disc I personally prefer physical copies, but I understand why digital media is taking over. It makes sense. As much as I don't like it, it makes sense. We are going to gain some time here. Even with those encounters, we're going to gain some time here. This won't be a gold split. I know it might be. It's going to be close. Nah, I don't think it'll be gold. Nope, it won't be gold, but we're going to gain some time. Let's go! <sighs> Hold on. Hold on, I gotta add this. Oh, wait. No, I'm not gonna mess with it. I don't want to mess with nothing. My computer was acting weird last earlier. For those of you who weren't here earlier, my computer completely crashed earlier tonight. So let's just not even touch it. We're fine. I haven't dropped any frames. I'm not gonna touch anything.
yeah, I mean, I get why they're going all digital. I do not think it's a good idea. I did, Serium. But when my computer crashed, I was out for probably five minutes, so I probably have a split VOD. <clears throat> Did we become the video games? <laughs> That's true though, Fisk. Fisk does make a good point. I mean, like when I, I install Wi-Fi for a living and it's expensive, and it's hard work, and it's dangerous, and it's dirty, and it sucks. I'm kidding. I, I actually like what I do for a living. It just... The only thing I don't like about my career is the inconsistency of the schedule because it affects what I do outside of work. I mean, streaming is something I prioritize right, right below work and family. Like, it's up there, you know what I mean? And I want to have a, a stable stream schedule so you guys can see streams you know, between X hour and X hour on these days every week. But that's just not the nature of construction, unfortunately, so I'm kind of at the mercy of whatever happens. Like, right now I'm on graveyards, so... You get the metabolism upgrade patch? What happens if your metabolism upgrade patch gets, like, bugs? Or then again, like, if everybody had six-pack abs, then would chubby people be considered sexy? Think about it, if like 95, if you, if you could eat burgers and pizza and skip sandwiches all day and you could have a six pack, like without even having to go to the gym, would that still be considered sexy or would that be considered like normal and then fat people would like, you'd have to go to the gym to be fat. Would that be considered sexy? That's weird. Nah. Oh my god, I don't know what I'm doing. It's been so long since I've done this. I think I did that right. But yeah, I'm not a big fan of the Google console at all. Like, I understand why they made it, and it probably will do okay. But I also think eventually it's going to fail, and Google's going to leave everyone who bought it hanging. Oh, I forgot to sell the defense spray. Damn it. That's why I was short on money. I was wondering why I was short on money. And I think that's enough to spend the night. There's a little rust there. Little rust. Oh, am I 40 short? Okay. I almost split.
Yeah, I, I probably bought one or two too many bottle rockets, but I was just being safe. I'm tired of having runs rip this late. The run should go all the way if I don't make any mental errors. And I don't screw up. I think the Wii U was a necessary evil to get the Switch. Because the Wii U was a great concept. Ooh, I'm an idiot. But I think that it was a little bit ahead of its time. I mean, regardless of whatever you want to say about the name or the marketing, the marketing scheme that they had. Um, so $40. Like, I know, the biggest thing I didn't like about the Wii U... Probably should've just taken $100 out, whatever. Wait! Oh, am I short still? Am I short? I'm short on money, aren't I? Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I've got 66. I'll double check real quick. Yeah, we're good. So here's a question that I was thinking about. How big of a time save would it be or why don't people do this couldn't you save I did it dumb I shouldn't have gone this way oh god oh this is bad oh you get a checkpoint you already knew what I was going to say didn't you say yep <laughs> yeah, I was thinking, like, why don't people death warp out of three, man? There's got to be a reason for it. Well, there you go. I don't want to fight a dog. Or I could just get that. Okay. I, that's fine. rough time biting the dog <laughs> it would be very rough but his fight is he's all barking no bite it's just hounding it's a it's an a, a encounter that really hounds you I will take a free copper bracelet thank you or silver bracelet whatever I'll take that it's free the Freed Cave! Let's go, Freed Cave! Let's go! Freed Cave, dude! One spawn, Jay. Yeah, why not? We bought extras. Let's do it. Let's just get out of here. Poopy hype! What's up, Steven? Thank you for the good luck, man. How you doing? Oh, <sighs> uh, why did I go back down? I was holding right. 
I've had really bad luck with spawns. Ooh. I didn't mean to get that butterfly. But now I'm close to full everything. So I might be able to skip spending the night now. Depending on how this goes. I'll take that bomb. Oop. It is a little more filled in. Uh, on April 1st, I'll be doing a 12-hour stream to raise money for Extra Life, a charity that supports children's hospitals. And anybody who donates can put money towards how they want my facial hair to be. I'm going to shave my beard to one of six styles. And anybody who donates can put money towards it. This is gonna be hard because I have the teddy bear. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> Dude, I should put the soul patch in there. How you doing, Steven? What's new with you, sir? Can I get past this guy? There we go. Oh, no, bear. Bear. There we go. That's better. I should put... I think I have a 90s goatee in there. I should do handlebars instead. Yeah, we're skipping spending the night. We're, we're going for it. Yellow strats. Let's go, baby. Hey, yellow strats have been working during this run. For those of you who missed my Captain Strong fight, when I had 22 HP, I did rock and rock and he he defended and then he did the little thing that raises his stats. I don't even remember what it is. And I got him. I was like, this run is dead. This run is not dead. Okay. Lost his temper, yeah. No. Nope, nope. Whatever. Hey, don't hit my teddy bear! That's what you get, Roach! You can't run from the roaches, can you? Nope, I screwed it up. Hey, look at Paula. Thank you, Tao. See you around, bros. Thanks for coming by. I hope you have a good night, sir. Here we go. Come on. Nah, there's an ant there. I was gonna go for it, but there was an ant there. I actually considered that Arithium. Legit. Nope. I actually considered putting the whole Kogan on there. And see that it is barren. Are you guys ready for a time save? Fuzzy Pickles! You guys ready for a time save? Check this out as I go use the restroom and I'll be right back. I'll be right back.
How far into the game is manipulatable? Uh, somebody answered it earlier, but as far as we know, it's up until Milky Well. <sighs> but it, uh, the Bubble Monkey makes it really difficult to, to get through winners, from my knowledge. Like, it's possible, but it's extremely unlikely. And I could be off on that, but... We have time to save here too. I'm still at full everything, so if I get through here with decent luck, I can skip the butterflies, and if I can skip the slime, we could save a lot of time. We'll see how that goes. Not, uh, careful, careful. Okay. I always get nervous picking the controller up right here. Oh no! That happened to me last time too! God damn it. That happened to me last run too. You're sorry, Crescendo. I'm sorry, Crescendo. You're fine. Oh. Oh, ha, ha. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Damn it. I should have just fought him. Nope. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna fight these guys. I can get past that jerk. Wow, Paula! She ate her Reedies. Hey, I still have a teddy bear. What the hell, Paula? Go, go, go. Get in there. I was gonna skip the butterfly, but I'm in here anyways. I might as well grab it. Nope. Nope. Just reset it. Come on. Damn it, I screwed that up. Probably gonna miss these attacks now. Just get out. the fastest I've ever gotten or the furthest I've ever gotten with a uh, teddy bear haha <laughs> -ha! jerk Usually it's gone by now. Look at my boy Jeff actually hitting for once. Look at my boy Jeff! PB hype! Um, 
top runners won't get the teddy bear in Paula's room. Froge? No concern, frogs. Don't forget the skip sandwich, James. The lag, I felt it. Uh, we may have to fight here. Let's go down and see if we can't despawn those guys. Okay, good. <sighs> ain't? Why you thought he's ain't? Okay, I wasn't too bad. Oh shit. Froge! Okay, that wasn't terrible. Oh yeah, I've learned that in this game. Crescendo. <laughs> this is, you've seen this. I've been, not maybe not this far ahead, but I've been ahead many, many times and had runs die. This is far from over. We're not even halfway. No problem, Bobby. No, thanks for hanging out, man. You believe in the power of love? I still have my bear. So this could be the urn. Yeah, this is Super Nintendo, Steven. Look at him hiding in the trees. What a creeper. I still have a couple extra bottle rockets. I still have the teddy bear. I've leveled up a little bit because I took some encounters, but I'm not over leveled to the point where I lost a ton of time. So what do you recommend, Arithium or anybody in chat who runs the game, what do you guys recommend for um, Mole Cave as far as my strat right now is to use Paula first. If she dies before Mole 3, I can get the Secret Herb pretty easily. And if I get through Mole 3, then I have Jeff, and I've got two big bottle rockets. What do you recommend? Do you recommend using the big bottle rockets first? Or does it matter? Stop it. Most people use the big bottle rockets. Thank you, Sirium. See, I thought about doing that strat because the last run I had that got this far ripped in Mole Cave because of my own dumb mistake, to be to be fair, I threw the damn herb away after I had a five rope, one duck encounter. That's not a bad idea, actually. That's not a bad idea, actually. I may consider that.
So we'll lose about 30 or 40 seconds here, but that's just because of my PB. I pretty much had no encounters to deal with coming back from Belch all the way through here. So I'd Uber fly. I didn't expect to, to gain time or anything there. I mean, the secret herb is literally just a backup for me. I don't plan on getting it because the encounter sucks. Um, but if I use Paula early and I end up getting solidified and she dies, then I can always get the secret herb and revive her and still use her. Whereas if I use, like, if what happened last time where Jeff gets wiped and Paula both get wiped, then I'm kind of in trouble. I don't know. I'm not sure. I guess I'll go. I'll trust you guys. I'll go with what you're telling. Booberfly? Yeah, I better, I better life up. I better, I better spend the night. I'd be dumb not to. I don't know. Maybe I should. Safety. Yo, JBT, Golden Kappa Man himself. What's up, dude? The JBT command lives on, sir. How you doing, man? Long time no see, man. How's it going? Yeah, I think you're right, Arithium. I think I'll do that. Oh, Doge. Bad Doge. I'll safety save. Why not? Wait. Oh, I didn't see the people. I was like, what? Homesick, let's go. I always get the dad right after I leave Mole Cave, so it's gonna be weird not getting the dad call as early as I normally do. It's gonna be weird. This is such a weird run. I mean, I, I'm digging it. So are they, apparently. Alright, snake. No snake! No snake! Snake! Why you do that, snake? Oh god, duck. I had to duck that encounter real quick. Hey, his mother works hard, okay, Husbo? But not too hard. Click. Beep, beep, beep. Snake. Okay, I felt, I felt the lag. Shouts out to Skate. <sighs> no! The teddy bear! What? That's bullcrap. Come on, Jeff. You had one job, dude. My bad. My bad. I knew that. I actually have it written down right there. I just got a little too lazy. Oh, God. Whew. Didn't look at my notes. Well, at least stuttering will be easier. Feel the lag. No King Snake rip run. Snake. Snake. That's my first big no problem here the entire run. Nice menuing there, buddy. Snake. 
that's one thing I need to practice too is how low do I need to go to despawn? Snake. Do I dare? I dare. Got him. Oh, ain'ts. How you do this, ain'ts? Ain'ts? Come on. Boy, Jeff, way to guts that out. My boy. And he outsped Paula, which is good. That means she's still gonna have her uh, peepees, which is good. <laughs> I probably could have stuttered that, but I was a little too scared. No, they're all the third best. <sighs> Wait, who got the picnic lunch? Okay. They should be called number two. As long as I don't make any derps like I did last run. Already got rock and B. That means I've been fighting too many enemies. That's where I got screwed last time. Ain't. Do this, ain't! Got him. I'm actually gonna get that PSI caramel. Shit. Not good, not good, not good. I wonder if I... If I went back right, would the ant be there? I think I'm just gonna get the, the caramel. He's uh, eh. yellow. Nope, I'm gonna fight him. I didn't even wanna deal with it. All right, that's fine. 918, yeah, I have enough. What's up, Bartea? I am doing good. Sorry, I'm, a little, I'm focused, so bear with me. But I'm good, how are you doing? Oh God, I thought that was like a Super Saiyan snake or something. Oh, come on, game. Really, it's the same two damn enemies, every time. Snake! 
Nah, I thought about trying it, but I was like, why is my D-pad doing that? If he's there again, I'm gonna stutter it. Okay, now I have two bombs. Oh god. Well. It's fine, it's just ducks. It's just ducks. Yeah, I have enough. No, you know what? Hold on. Let's just rocket him. Bash, bash. This is fine. Heh, <laughs> I might have overkilled this a little bit. That's okay. I don't know if you could run from ducks. I'm sure you probably could. Oh yeah. Yeah, just for safety. We're gonna have a big time save here anyways. Well, I'm glad I got that butterfly. God damn it. That's not good. So much for the big time save. Finish him, Jeff. Okay, good. <sighs> What's up, Canada Phone? I was so close, I should have just went back. I got way too greedy. Of course he's hitting Paula every time. PB hype! That's fine. What X's are representing for PP? That means that, yeah, they're mute, basically. They can't use psychic powers. Fuzzy pickles! We got into that cave without losing the teddy bear. That's pretty cool. Just wanted to double check. Let's go. Oh, I was about to say. I almost got all the way through the desert without getting sunstroke once. That'd have been pretty cool. Okay, here we go. Oh boy, who's excited for the department store? As far as I know, Artea. I'll s drop that.
Now watch me take an encounter right in front. Okay, and... Never even had to use those bombs. Okay, good. I probably should drop those bottle rockets too. Yeah, might as well. Shopping hype! How you doing, Lila Vera? Uh, welcome back. Sorry, we get a concert before. In the, in the honor of my man, Pronzo and Steven, we get a concert before we go shopping. I need to get rid of that croissant too. Croissant. Our fans are waiting, baby. I like how they take their instruments in here. Like, I, I wonder if those instruments are like super glued to their fingers. The <laughs> maestro baiter. <laughs> I'm glad you're feeling yourself, Steven. <laughs> as long as you're not playing <laughs> with your Wii. Oh my god. Best stream ever. Those kids are hip, baby! Oh yeah! Dude, I will totally do the Hulk Hogan. I should do that. I should do the Hulk Hogan. I don't know. I, I have to rock the hair that gets chosen for two weeks. Maybe I should do that as like a donation incentive. Like if we raise X amount of money, then I'll do the Hulk Hogan. Well, I mean, I could, I could do the skull of it. I'd have to like, I don't know, my this, the back of my hair is not long enough. I don't think my hair is long enough to do it. So, I don't think it would work. <laughs> I would have shaved my beard weeks ago if it wasn't for my wanting to do this. The Macho Man, oh yeah! Did you ever know that you're my hero? Oh yeah! It's pretty thick. Shopping hype, let's go. Okay, we learned our lesson last time. We did not have enough of the things to survive, so I'm gonna go a little overboard buying shit here. Anything I don't need. Refreshing herb, gone. Need all that. Oops. Okay, good.
Why does it feel like I'm forgetting something? Oops. Thanks, Boof. It feels like I'm forgetting something. I mean, I like, I like a beard. It's just hard to have him in the summertime here. Stage, Todd. I'm gonna buy one. Eh, yeah, one more. I'd rather do it overboard. Okay, we are fully loaded, we're fully healed. And we've got Paula. We've got Paula. Paula's gonna walk us through this department store. It's gonna happen. Okay, this is fine. Well, we are gonna have plenty of time. This is fine. That was my own fault. That was my own fault. This is fine. We're gonna lose a little time, but at least it happened early. This is fine. We're gonna lose a little time, but we're good. That was my own fault. I never take encounters on that on that uh, floor. That's the first time I've ever taken an encounter on that floor. Although it wouldn't have mattered too much because I got wrecked. Even if that had been the encounter I take on floor uh, four. Because I'm way under leveled, Crescendo. I'm way under leveled for what I'm supposed to be right now. Well, this is the biggest time save I have, but unfortunately, ooh. Ooh. Give him a BBR. You duck. This actually ended up being decent. Even with that, this ended up being decent. We'll lose a little time from what I could have had. Oh, I forgot. Oh, Skate, I'm sorry, Skate. Don't tell Skate. Nobody tell him. Okay, Super Bomb. It's been so long since I've been this far. <laughs> I think we're in there. Not bad. Even with a death in department store, I gained 3 minutes and 47 seconds. Wow. 
Oh, my PB is so bad, dude. And I don't have to refill all my items. So we're we're in good shape. Especially if you get pump skip. If you get pump skip, then you save like literally a million minutes. Like literally. What's up, random? How you doing, sir? I don't even know where I'm going. Apparently I went the right way. Yes, I'm Jay. You know Jay, Everdread. Remember, you're mashing no here. You ready for it? But yeah, those uh, those enemies in department store are hard, even casually. When you are not under leveled, they're extremely hard. I almost think the game like, expects you to get the teddy bear. Which wouldn't be the worst safety in a row, like in a race or something. Nope, no pump skip, that's fine. remember how to get through here without encounters I got so many BBRs on for safety. I don't even want to mess with it, man. Let's just get out of here. Oh, you can hypno them. That's good to know. I didn't know that. I kind of wish I had given that to Jay, but that's fine. soft lock just let the text happen just making sure everything was okay we're good see we're, we're, we're good I need to make sure Is that a spawn? If that's a spawn, I'm gonna go back up. That is a spawn. No, sir, I will not. Okay, go, 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 go!
Kill him! What? Good boy. Come on. This has to kill him or it's rip. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow, that was such bad luck, dude. Okay, take your time and make sure that you give the secret herb to Jay. Okay, we're gonna give a super bomb to- oh, I can't use it. Oh, this is bad. What do I do? Do I just go for it? Can I get through Monkey Cave without being able to fight? I do have to go to the hospital? Okay, we'll just go. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. Okay. Just because Ness missed the stupid rockin'. Well, and the other thing I was worried about is if I got in a fight with the mole, I don't have any offense except for super bombs, I guess. It's fine, we'll go to the hospital. We'll lose a little time here, but that's fine. The run was nearly dead, so I don't mind losing a minute here, it's whatever. Careful. Okay. As long as I don't get in an encounter here, we're okay. Alright, we're in there. Sour, please! It's almost worth it. We almost got some of the good music. Yeah, that would have sucked, Crescendo. That would have really sucked. Yeah, dude, Sari and uh, Arithium have really been like my guardian angels in learning this game. They've really helped me so much. No, cranky lady! So we'll lose a little time, but that's fine. Because I have time to save later in the run, too. I have a lot of time saves later. So, it's perfectly fine. I'm glad the Manip lasted as long as it did. Got it all the way through the ant. I might have had a shot at all of my of on it, except for I made a stupid input mistake. And that's fine. It just means that I have time saves for the next run. And yes... If you haven't, if you missed it earlier, I announced that in this run, I am going for sub four. It's official. That is my new goal in this game: is sub four. So even after I get my goal time for the trials and I start my next game, I still plan on running this at least once a week. Get out of the way, monkey! Nice! Yeah, I'm not very good at Smash. The few times I played online, I played against Metroid McFly and uh, Apollo. I do that every time, every single time. like when you talk to him again, he says crap. Wait, I was supposed to go in the right door. Darn it. It's fine. This is fine. It's fine. I don't 
don't even need that. I keep doing the dumbs. Do I not have King Banana? Wait. Oh, I screwed up again. I screwed up again. Good lord. This is rust. There goes another 30 seconds. I was like, wait a second, I don't have King Banana. Yeah, so here come the time losses. From both having to go to the hospital and my derp just now, but that's a small derp, it's okay. I love Monkey Cave. Not because of what it is for the speedrun, just in general, I just think it's cool. This is one of my favorite parts in the vanilla game when I ran it, when I played it casually. So yeah, we lost about a minute. Not bad. I didn't want to give that to R, but that's fine. Boy, what is that? This is what all true warriors strive for. Holy raid! My man, RC Drone with that humongous raid. Does that mean we have some good news from my dude? RC Drone, thank you for the raid. Welcome everybody from Drone Stream. My name's James, I go by JSR. I am not running Zelda today. Welcome to Earthbound. We're about eh, halfway or so through a run. No PB? Ah! Oh, I got excited for a second. I was like, yo, dude, let me hear some good news, man. How you doing tonight, dude? How was your stream? Ooh. So close, dude. Nope, nope, nope. Mole? Mole? Ha <laughs> ha! Stupid mole. Wait. Oh, I didn't talk to the monkey. Son of a gun. Uh, I use my right thumb, Sari. And that's a habit I got from Zelda 1. Because the way I screen scroll is uh, I hold the controller like this and I rock the D-pad, then I flick like that. And I just got really good at like, uh, just kind of doing that. I never did. Huh. I'll have to mess with it. Is it easier for, with your index finger, or is it kind of like a runner by runner thing? Hey, how dare you take my fish machine! I'm not coming to see you. You look like a clown. No, I've never I've never thought about it. Z1 screen scrolls are a one frame tap, so for me, flicking the D-pad with my thumb works really well. I've never thought about stuttering, like, with the index finger. I think it's mostly just muscle memory, though. Alright, can we get a zero bot... Monotoli, like we had in the run that ripped... This is the second furthest run I've had since my PB. Nope. 
Come, come on. Get in there. There we go. Well, we might get one bot here. Got it. I think we're in there. Three bombs, four bombs. Cool. clumsy. Remember that time you ripped my run, you jerk? Baby, hype! Even forgetting the monkey. Some runners flick like that. I just tap with my thumb. The side of my thumb, more more uh, specifically. How dare you stop, Jay? Never stop, Jay. That was probably my best Monotoli I've ever had. Ooh, I almost said yes. forget do I want to I'm gonna give everything to Jeff now and distribute bombs now just to be safe cuz I always forget what's up hyper strike how you been man hope you're well it's been a while Nice, man. How did that go? Da da dot. I love this part. This music is so hype. Yo, Beeb Bob 26. Thank you for the follow. Ah, Apple Kid. Come on, Apple Kid. Now, I'm supposed to give the pencil eraser to Paula, aren't I? I just don't know if that's something you do now, or if you do that later. Oh! Get out of my way! I'm trying to headbang! Right, Ness just looking at her in the eyes now, like, girl, I'm sorry, but them hips are just too much. Thank you for the follow, puppy high five.
speeding through these tunnels. No speed limit. No stop signs. No traffic on the bridge. If you've ever been to New York City, you know that is BS. There's always traffic on the bridge. No traffic in, in Earthbound. Rush hour is canceled, motherfucker. The highway to hell, my good man. I've never... I don't know too much about d and I know uh, a few people who play it, but I couldn't tell you a thing about it. I just know it's a card game where you roll dice and keep track of stats and fight warriors and dragons and stuff. <laughs> I do want to go to New York City once. I, I drove through the outskirts a couple of times on the way to GDQ, but um, I've never... I've never gone um, through the actual city. So this is one of those parts where the game is kind of cryptic. Like, uh, when I was watching Cool Kid play this casually, and he didn't know what to do next. And without the player's guide, how would you? All he says is there's a, a gadget here. Okay. Well, what kind of gadget could be here? I have no idea what you're talking about. It's one of those cryptic areas of the game. There's a lot of cryptic stuff. Like, if you're ever thinking about playing this blind, do not feel guilty if you need a player's guide or a walkthrough. The game came with a player's guide. It takes you all the way through the game. It's probably more satisfying to do it without a player's guide, but good luck is all I can say. All right, I'll be right back. Feels good to have your Franker face emotes back. Well, now you have puppers in FFZ. You can have puppers in chat at any time. You do not need to be a subscriber anymore. I have new sub emotes coming. They're just awaiting approval. And hopefully, they've been waiting approval for a while, so hopefully it's soon. And anybody can add puppers to their channels, too. If you want a uh, little Zelda. We do have concern up. We have lots of concern. James is running Earthbound. There's always concern. Do I even need to heal? I don't. We're going for it. Let's go. Risking it for the fist bit. That's not good. Oh, that was a terrible roll, too. 
This is bad. That was a good roll, okay. We're going for it, this is bad. All right, we're in. Whew. Hurry, hype! I haven't gotten dad call yet, did I? I didn't get dad call yet. got dad call did I am I tripping did I not get dad call oh you're right Sarium you're right you're right okay <laughs> I was like wait what I was like, maybe I discovered something new. No, no, you didn't. You just discovered you got wrecked in department store. That's all you discovered. Do I talk to him? Yeah, I talked to him. That is nothing new. No, this is not eSports. Thank you for the follow, though. Notori7. Okay. I don't know the new DX sandwich route yet. So, what I think I'm going to end up doing is just loading up. Um, loading up on sandwiches before cracking. I'm not gonna worry about it right now. <clears throat> I just hope I can get through this run. I mean, I'm getting hungry. Thank you, Mad Bomber. Take this man's driver's license away. Okay, no photo triggers. That's the, the goal here. No photo triggers. Is he even old enough to have one, right? Yeah, pilot's license. Same thing. Kate! Skate will never forgive me if I don't do this. I have to do what? Well, okay, we're at double A now. Sorry, Skate, I'm double A. I feel lag. That's not good. Nope, not today, buddy. club known as the hottest bar in summers but every drink is on the rocks
Uh, you can teleport away from encounters at this point in the game, Crescendo. Like, right? Yeah, I'll just go back in. I almost did it right there. We lost four seconds, rip run. That was that stupid encounter that cost me time. Jay had a stream, and it was a very clear and very strange dream. Because he ate a magic cake. Concern. Can I get some concern in chat for all of the magic in that cake? What is that? Johnny One P with the 12 plus 1. I actually do resub sometimes when my Prime renews. Shout outs to Mustangs and Andy for caring my ass. <laughs> Shouts out to Andy, Andy, and Mustangs are awesome indeed. Yo, thank you for the resub, Johnny. 13 months. Welcome back to the Puppy Pound. This music is so kick-ass. God, I love this game, dude. As much as I hate this game, I love this game. Oh, you can't glide that. Okay, I'm learning. Boober fly! No worries, Hyper Strike. Thanks for stopping by, bros. You're gonna miss and get my arms ripped off. Take it easy, bros. I like how Pants added that little Zelda at the end. <laughs> I see it hiding there. Oh, shit. Don't break my legs! Ouch! I like the little thud when he hits the ground. Boom. Ooh. That's what I imagine him, him making that sound effect. <laughs> Unfortunately, you can hear my mashing, so I can't even pretend like I'm miming. I love how my notes say, open nothing, go south, lose mind. <laughs> Anxious night owl, how are you doing? Some of them adjust the quality of the games or an input lag. As far as I know, it do I don't think so. I'm playing on original hardware on an actual Super NES through, a, uh, through an Elgato HD60. And a frame meister. This is RGB that you're seeing. It's not an uh, emulator. Um, but as far as I know, all, all real hardware can't be changed by the capture equipment. So if that if that is a thing, it's probably just with emulator, I guess. I don't know. I could be mistaken, but as far as I know, I've never heard of that. Gain time here. That's that uh, gliding. I don't know. Nah, I don't know. I don't know. This is split is pretty much the same every time. If I do lose time or game time, it's gonna be micro. Yeah. Yeah, I'm playing on a PBM. Oh, I almost got a freaking photo trigger.
Okay, so I need to give some of the super bombs to Pooh. I just really get stuck on this stupid sarcophagus. Sarcophagus! faster than that, buddy. Hey, Sega man. Ding! And hello, Shadow. Okay, so let's give the hieroglyph copy to S, the mummy wrap to S, and that's it. We're good. And then I need the life up, Jeff. Get out of my way, puff guy. I don't even know why I went down in the first place. Get out of my way, people. Ooh, I probably should do another one. That was a weak life up. There, just being safe. So, Kate, Never gold. Sorry, I'm focusing on menuing. Give me a second. Where do we have to get all these sandwiches? And if I get enough, if I fix you some sandwiches, then we'll be good for the rest of the game. I think. Okay, I need to leave a couple inventory spots open. We'll have an inventory spot open after the Kraken fight. One more should be enough. Let's do one more. I'd rather go overboard here. $18 in the bank. Come on, Dad. 
thought you were rich. All right, here we go. Kate. No photo. After all, it could only cost you your life and you got that for free. So as long as we outspeed crapping, then um, we'll be good. I'm gonna lose a little time on this split because I bought more sandwiches, but I did, I had to go back in my PB and buy sandwiches before I went to the cave of the past. So I think the time save is gonna offset, if not be worth it. I think it'll be worth it towards the end of the run. So even if I lose some time here, we'll be okay. And if we get first turn Paula and we get the mummy wrap off, we should in theory be able to wipe out the Kraken in two turns. We'll see. Wait! So yeah, we're gonna lose a little time, but that's fine. We'll make that time up later in the run, as long as I don't use too many skip sandwiches. I really want to use up maybe two or three of poos at the most. I want to save a couple in case the uh, the walk from Dungeon Man to the trees goes badly, or in case uh, I'm low on PP or something. Oh no! Uh, this is bad. This might be rip. wanted Ness to die there. I didn't even know what just happened. Is that better? Sirium? Should I have died? Oh my god. <laughs> hey, Shiri Bear. Well, this is good. Yeah, we'll just go to the hospital. It's fine. Oh, I didn't split. Oh well. It's the power of love. <laughs> Holy heck indeed, Shadow. Wow, thank you, Shuri. The beard's gonna be gone April 1st, well, April 2nd. I'm doing a charity stream to raise money for it. I was half expecting to, uh... Sour, please! Oh, this music is so good. Go! Nope, go this way. That's not the way. It's fuzzy freaking pickles! Damn it! Hey, True Blue! I always forget which side it's on. This is the rust from not playing this game, not getting this far in a run in a month. I can't believe the crystal charm didn't work. Or, I mean, the mummy wrap didn't work. I'm so bummed out that that didn't work. It's fine. I just wanted to get past that sp spooka or whatever his name is. I do not... I'll try it. I know you're supposed to...
I know you're supposed to teleport up. Let's try it. I think that's it? Yeah, there we go. What? What? Shenanigans! Tomfoolery! What did I do wrong? Oh! Shit. Overkilled a little bit. I panicked a little bit. Well, at least everything hit Jeff. I probably shouldn't have revived him, but oh well. Oh no, I need him for uh, Guardian General. Could just take the encounter here. Not from him. was not a good room. That's fine. Wow. I keep getting stuck. game. Oh, I shouldn't do this. I knew I shouldn't have done that. That was dumb. That was dumb. I'm not sure what to do here. sure if I should just run away.
Screw it, let's just get out of this fight. Not good. So what's the strap of that room? Do you just keep going till you get no spawns? Because, I mean, that was not ideal. Oh, get out of here. This is not good. We're going to lose time. This was a terrible, terrible pyramid. Okay, I only have enough... to do one rocking because I need to be able to heal Ness. Thank you. I have to get out of here, so this is going to be a little sketch. And I didn't get enough to gain any more life ups. So... This is a little scary. <sighs> I might take the, uh, yeah. I, I just, I'd rather just get out of here. Alright, so if, if Jeff, if Pooh dies, he dies, because I don't have enough. I don't have enough PP to do much else, so if Jeff dies, or if Pooh dies, he dies. Come on, game. Come on, game. Oh, good lord. I could... No. I wish I knew what to do against those guys. To get out of there quicker. Just losing time. Just losing time, losing all my time. It's so great, losing all my time. Okay, I'm making it, I'm gonna make a break for it. Just have to survive. Damn it, I got hung up. Oh, Paralyze Omega. Oh, I needed that bad.
Not bad. I'll take a one encounter there. I think we're out. Just his last snake. Whew. Nice. Time save coming up here. Well, I don't know actually because I had such a terrible I had such a terrible Hawkeye room. Oh god. Zelda Nut, thank you very much. It's a lot of fun. I love this game. They got Sub 1 and Mario Odyssey. My god. That's insane. I'm, I have to learn Odyssey as part of the trials. I'm not terribly looking forward to it. I do that every time. Yo, this is the right way. The right way. Right way. I do this every time. I get mixed up there. Don't fight that guy. And never fight that guy. Never fight those. That is Rip Run. If you fight diamonds, your run is done. Run is done. Diamonds are rough. They're rough. They're rough like a dog's bark. Ugh. Look at those ducks. They're trying hard. PB hype? PB hype? What? How was I? How did I? T what? What? How did I save time there? Oh god! Oh, thank you for the green swirl. Thank you for the green swirl. I do that every single run. Every single run. Might as well give it to Jeff. He's the one that has IQ. Alright. I don't think I can teleport with Junja Man. That's okay. That's okay. I, I wanted this photo. I wanted this photo for memories. For memories of that Kraken fight. Run that should not be alive. Nope. Nope! Well, at least I got it before Dungeon Man went away. Get him, Dungeon Man! Get him, Dungeon Man! Atta boy! Atta boy!
<laughs> he needs to lose a few pounds. Yeah, he got, a little, he got a little hung up in the trees there. Wait, do I have enough money? Do I have enough money, or do I need more money? I mean, it's kind of too late. I'm already committed, but... I think I have enough. 13-9. Oh, God, I almost went back down. And I have the uh, platinum band, too, that I can sell. And uh, I'll have the ribbon! Diamonds! Is this? That's pretty tight. I didn't know that, Shay. I actually didn't know that. There's lots of little things in this game that I'm learning as I speedrun that I, I thought I knew everything about this game. And I learned something new about it almost every time I run it. Like, the kids that give you the Mr. Baseball cap, those are the little rascals. I never knew that. Yo, antlers, thank you. You do see some glods, man. How you doing? It actually samples it. That's pretty cool. No protoplasms. That's good news. Poopy hype! Wait. No, 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 no. Fake hype. Fake hype. Fake hype. Sorry. Sorry. False alarm. I like how it says in my notes, talk to face! We have to save $150 for all the stuff. We need 12 plus multi-bottle rockets. I'll sell the bracelet and the ribbon just for safety, but I think I'm good on money. This might still be a gold split. That is a gold. Now it's PB hype. There we go. Now we're in there. That's okay. I just don't want to accidentally over teleport. It's fine. No, oh, you jerk. I think I still have super bombs that I need to get rid of. Yeah, hold on a second. Let's give these super bombs to Jay, Paula, just for now. I still have a skip on there. I need to get rid of that skip sandwich and give that to Paula as well. Hang on. Do I have anything else on there that I don't want? I need the... Wait. I still have another skip. There we go. I want the big bottle rocket for uh, the Mondo Mole. have enough I'm broke okay so I'll just go through with what I got now but I'll have to come back and buy some bottle rockets it's based on speed true blue That sucks. 
I gotta remember to come back. I only have eight bottle rockets. That's not enough to beat the game. Okay, I just don't want to overdo it. I'd rather do a couple extras. Oh, uh, well, it gives them a better chance. The higher the speed, the better your odds are. It's not like a static number. Man, I'm getting really good RNG here. Okay, I'm gonna do a dumb. Ah, that's what I get. <laughs> I thought I could make it up that. It's fine. boy baby what hype oh we got a casey bat oh yeah yeah this game stinks i got poo comes in at the last second like gandalf just to get all the xp Yeah, he's the, he's still alive. Just get rid of that Casey bat. It's bad luck. Okay, so we're not going to go to Winters just yet. Well, I guess we could go to Winters to get money out of the ATM. I could also just do that later. You know, I'll wait. I'm okay. We're good. I've got seven multi-bottle rockets. I should be fine. No, uh, Gygus McGygus is the final boss. Oh, wait till you see the final boss, Crescendo. It's a trip. Please don't diamondize me, game. That's not what I wanted to see. That isn't what I wanted to see either. Nor is that. Oh, God. Help me, please. Help me, please. I'm gonna die in a second. Oh my god. Help me, please. I'm gonna do a dumb. No. This part is fucking scary. This part is scary as fucking fuck. If I die, I might cry. And I don't know why. I just have to get to here. Dry your tears, don't go that way. That's a photo trigger. Where the hell am I going? Chewing gum. Guess what, we get a return. Can I get some purple dinosaurs in chat, y'all? I need some purple dinosaurs. Let's go. My bad pants always coming through. I love it. Hey, Fried Bow, thank you for the MS Paint 
Seri Beasts. Or what is the emote? I always forget. Seri Nessie. I always just type in Ness and it pops up. Serium has a very impressive collection of Nessies. Of Tessies, I'm sorry. Tessies, not Nessie. Tessie. Get it right, James. This part sounds like it could be a Beatles sample. Thank you. Unrelated Pants, Fried Bow, The Man with the Hex, Serium, Shafit, for all of the purple dinosaurs and variations. Much appreciated. We need that. It's good luck. It's an RNG manipulation. And we say goodbye to our friend. He has carried us this entire run. No monsters in the deep, just a friendly purple beast. I would have laughed if he'd gone back in the water with the monkey on his head. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. That's what I want to see in life, is poor bubble monkey drown. Screw that monkey. What? That did not work. Oh, I was going the wrong way. <sighs> Bait. 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 Why are you doing this, Bait? Crocodile. Croco. And the cockroach! Oh, bait! Bait! Get out of my way, bait! Why you do this? No, not that bad! That bad wanted to scrap, dude! Okay, we are gonna safety save because this area sucks all the ass. Make sure you talk to the mouse this time, James. I think in my PV, actually, I might have gone down. And not talk to the mouse. Okay, so after we beat this area... Hey, Eagleus! Yeah, after we beat this area, I'll go get bottle rockets. I can actually get a couple extras now. We're good for right now. I actually kind of did that on purpose because I'm going to use a couple in here. This is one of the scariest parts of the run. One, two, three, four, five, go. Hey, it worked that time. Oh, I need to use one of Paula's skip sandwiches up so I can put the pencil eraser on Paula. <sighs> okay, that was good luck. Nah, that's not good luck. Get out of here, diamonds. Diamond? I can do this. Oh no! Oh no! No! Shit, this is bad! Hypnosis is hypnosis. Shit. Get 
Get out! Oh! Oh! Nope, 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 nope. I need to life up everybody. I don't know why I haven't done that yet. Hey, Urtai, uh, that is my gold splits. Oh, God. Go, 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 go. Okay, at least it wasn't a red swirl. Oh, boy. That's just, uh, that, that was a, sorry, hold on. Um, no, that, that last split got messed up somehow. I don't know how. But I am, I am not, uh, it's weird. I did manipulation in this run. No, don't even mess with it. Just redo it. Let's go. Sorry, this is a super stressful part. <sighs> At least it's not a mook robot. That hurt. I didn't even want to mess with it. No, if you get a green swirl, true blue, you can run away. And certain enemies are more susceptible to it than others. Like the mooks, if you paralyze, if you uh, hypnotize them, you can run from them. Certain enemies you can do that, others you can't. Oh god, get out of there. Nice. Don't forget the exit mouse. Oh god. That was not the exit mouse chamber. I don't know where I was going. Stop it! No, oh, no. Oh, <laughs> I hate this game! Oh. I was hoping to get a green swirl. Good. I always open that, that chest and regret it later. Oh god, oh god, oh god. We still have a lot of skip sandwiches. I bought maybe too many. I'd rather have too many than not enough, though. 
And I haven't had to use a, a Desperation multi-bottle rocket yet, so we're in good shape. Alright, now don't forget the exit mouse. No problem, Steven. Thanks for hanging out, man. Good to see you, bros. Mooks in this area. I want to be careful. Stupid mooks. It's fucking mooks over here. It's mooks, huh? Starman base at all, and we're out. All right, so the hype column is just uh, against gold splits. Um, I don't know why Barfman was gold. It shouldn't have been, but the split I just had was 43 seconds over gold. Yes, he's harvesting people for energy, like straight out of the Matrix. Talk to Apple Kid, use the exit mouse, and now we want to go buy bottle rockets. See ya! Oh, this game gets darker! Let's go to On It. We get the exit mouse. We'll get the book. We'll go back to deep darkness. We'll buy a ton of bottle rockets. And we should be good. Slight time loss there, but it's insurance. I saw a ton of time to save like on this split. my way dude I love being able to walk through this town without having to worry about manipulation it's great <laughs> not for long we have another tough area ahead of us although this isn't as hard I don't think I don't think this area is nearly as hard Minor time loss, we're fine. This is fine. Hey, Mr. Penguin. That lag, though. Oh, don't talk to him. So I need to move something from Ness to Paula. I'll, I, I never did move the pencil eraser, so we'll do that now. Thank you for the follow, Mr. Penguin. Puppy high five for you. And we take a picture now to commemorate the puppy high five. Fuzzy Pickles.
Hey you! I have a little happy question for you. Hey, we had to go team A. We had to. Let's see. Give this to Pooh. Give this to Pooh. Well, I don't want to say it without spoiling it, so... You'll see. The ending is, if you... If you know what the ending's about, like, it's not as bad as everyone makes it out to be. There's lots of theories. I don't want to spoil it, but the ending's kind of crazy. Man, no foppies? Oh, I, I spoke too soon. Oh god, just go. Nice. This is the scariest part of this level. Tempted just to fight him. Oh god, not all three of them. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I got a green swirl out of it, so that's cool. No, I don't want to fight three. Oh shit. Oh, I may mean, have no choice. Okay. Hey, camera tech. Oh, that didn't do shit. Got him. Oh, good lord, that didn't do a damn thing. Get out of there. Okay, I'm gonna have to make a run for it. Okay, if that's my only encounter, I'm pretty happy. Okay, that was actually decent. Let's see if I can get a no foppy. I mean, if foppies aren't the worst thing to, to fight, I don't want to fight that guy. I'd rather fight foppies. If I get another foppy, I'll just fight him. Eh, ah, whatever. Let's go. For safety. Probably didn't even need to do fire there. Yeah, they're really good enemies to grind, but it's a lot of time to fight them, though. Even though that's not that much time. Ooh. Who do I want to fight here? Poppies. That's fine. I don't have enough H or PP to do a Star Storm, so we'll do this. Well, we're not gonna gain, we're not gonna gold this. Mm. 
But we can still gain time if I get through. Ooh, I never went back. That's fine. Yeah, something like that. save time okay so I now I need to give the rabbit's foot to Ness and I need to go buy bottle rockets I need to like now <laughs> I can't believe I forgot to do that it's okay though it's about the same as if I had done it earlier I can't remember when I'm supposed to equip the Night Pendant. Is that just for... When am I supposed to equip the Night Pendant? I don't have that in my notes, do I? Is it before Fire Springs? Like, right before uh, Diamond Dog? It says in my notes to equip the Sea Pendant. One more really difficult place to get, and then we have a little bit of a free ride for a while. As long as I don't make any dumb mistakes. We have Fire Spring is really difficult. Oh, you don't take the Sea Pendant to Madison, that's right. Fire Spring is very, very scary. Um, and Madison. Is scary and then of course the end of the game is scary but those are the only really really scary places left no problem Johnny have a good night dude thanks for hanging out bros <laughs> all right so we'll teleport from here to lost underworld I can do it right here or to deep darkness we'll buy bottle rockets then we have to go to foreside and during the Venus show I gotta use the restroom <laughs> so let's see how many I have left six I'll buy three more. It's probably overkill. I could buy a couple more super bombs, actually. That probably wouldn't be a bad idea. one more and that's enough
There's no dinosaurs inside. They're all replicas, but I'm sure everyone knows that. <clears throat> so during the Venus show, I'll go use the restroom, and then we get to go fight the Wraith. Yo, thank you for the follow, Maguire72. Don't know if you already got your puppy high five, but if you did, thank you. <clears throat> oh, was she? She was dancing to the uh, puppy high five? <laughs> That's awesome. All right, so we're going to go deep into the sewers of doom. And in my PB, I had a very rough fight against a cockroach before the rat. Where he nearly, there were two cockroaches, they red swirled me and they nearly wiped me. So I do have a little bit of a time save here, about two minutes. Um, I don't think I can gold this because I went and got uh, bottle rockets. So I'm thinking the, the time save here might get offset because of the bottle rockets. But my shopping is done for the rest of the run, unless I screw something up. I do have a couple extra skips that I could use um, in Fire Spring if I need to. Here we go. This part's pretty easy. Because we're, believe it or not, we're actually slightly over leveled I think then we're supposed to be you're supposed to do this immediately after you get poo ah we got a second no problem here I'm not sure what your casual level is supposed to be when you do this but I don't remember ever having rockin uh sigma or whatever it is the third one <laughs> rockin sigma rockin rockin ligma I can't remember exactly what your casual level is supposed to be here, but we're not as underleveled as we typically are. So we should be able to... Gamma, thank you. Uh, Draconic... Rockin' is Ness's PSI power. Um, Paula and Pooh have elemental powers. Elemental P powers. That's funny. Sorry. Um... Ness only has one psychic attack that actually does damage, and it's his, uh, PSI rockin'. Oh, oh, okay, my bad. <laughs> Uh-oh. Let's see if we can get rid of that guy. Uh, 
Now, I know there's a few people in chat who haven't seen as many Earthbound runs, so I, my bad. Alright, no ninja, no ninja cockroaches or rats or anything. Come on, nope. Get away from me. Pee pee wee wee, what kind of stream is this? Oh, shit. Stop it. Dude, that new emote is so cute. I love it, dude. That, that new emote is, uh, is the, the shit. All right, normally I would go up there, but I don't want to mess with that trash can, so we're just going to go in the water here. Probably lost a couple seconds, but if I had taken the encounter, I would have lost like 30 seconds, so it's fine. What sucks is it's really hard to despawn encounters when you're in the water because of how slow you move. The good thing is that because you move so slow, you don't accidentally walk too far, so it's easier to see them coming. <laughs> right? We're almost there. Can still save time. We didn't get any encounters up here. If this fight goes clean, we could save time here. Except for I don't have the rabbit's foot on Ness. Don't need it. Nice. Even with going shopping, we still save time. Yeah, you know, this game has is amazing, casually. It's a fun speedrun, too. It's a lot of fun. I really enjoy this as a speedrun. I really do. Like, I want sub-4 now. So a long way from it. If I get the manip all the way through on it, I probably would be 24 minutes ahead, maybe less, 23 minutes ahead. If I can get it all the way through Tucson, though, I think we'd probably be on, like, a 4 third, like, a 4 10 for 15 pace So I mean it's not out of the realm of possibility if I learn the manip Grandma, please you can't even walk that fast You're not even using your cane tension holic Oops, we checked. We just want to make sure. Oops, how did I get hung up on the invisible part of that roof? Game, please. get this headbanging music again let's go okay so I actually want to put the rabbit's foot back on Jeff now wait what what did I just give him oh, I gave him the exit mouse oh well wait hold on no I'm an idiot I'm an idiot I just lost time for nothing Wow. Just in case. Let's just go. Good lord, I'm an idiot, dude. Because I need the rabbit's foot to run from these guys. I was worried I'd forget to put it back on before Thunder and Storm. gonna get me. Alright. 
Pick up poison, right? That's why you put the rabbit's foot on Ness. Don't want that. Get out of my way. Good RNG so far. We're going up against the gold split, so... That was a really good area. So we lost a little time because of my menuing snafu, but it's fine. Just for safety. <laughs> now, in my PB, I nearly wiped because I forgot to give the rabbit's foot to Jeff before the fight. I also had a very rough fight. So I have a little bit of time to save in the front end and then a ton of time to save afterwards because the backup strat I used was to go back into the fire spring after using the exit mouse and getting the bag of Dragonite which I used to save the run. If I don't make that same mistake twice, I could probably save like a minute and a half here, maybe more. And no encounters coming out, that's good. They look like the ghosts in the Casper movie. <laughs> they actually did a little bit. Alright. Hey, Blazing. Um, it, not, it gives it a higher chance of hitting. It also does more damage because it's based on his speed. Ooh, this is not a good combo. But the, the rabbit's foot also increases Ness's speed, which helps you run from enemies. So when you have it equipped on Ness, it gives you a higher probability of running from enemies. And we're really going to need that perk coming up here in a moment. Don't know if that's faster. It might be. I don't like teleporting with A here because it's so easy to teleport out and it's such a long trek. So I kind of set myself up like that. Yeah, that was definitely slower. Nope. Now... <sighs> Skate Man tells me I need to get the D item or Kings or whatever. I think I'm gonna listen to Skate. I'm gonna go grab it. And I'm gonna give it to Pooh. Just for safety. Can I teleport around this guy? Do I even want to risk it? No, let's just go in the cave. Clunky Kings, I'm sorry. It's safety against Gygus, right? That's why people get it. It's for safety against Gygus. Oh, gosh. Okay. Let's just go around him. Come on, Chompo Sore. Hey, Mars, right? Yeah, I know this is a great game. This is one of my favorite games of all time. 
and I'd beaten it so many times casually. I'm, I'm pretty happy I got to learn the speed run. Uh-oh. Are we gonna get a geyser now? Nope, no geyser. Here we go. No safety save either. Let's go. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, baby. First try. Oh, baby. I probably could have made a break for that one, but I was... Uh, I don't think I can make that one. Okay, we're gonna have to deal with this one. That's fine. Okay, we hypnotize the elemental. run come on okay make a run for it go oh I got a green swirl out of it that's fine this is why I don't like doing this strat right here I almost want to take the encounter, but those are psychos, man. I don't like the psychos. Okay, it was a green swirl. Okay, that was really good. Careful, I did not want to go in that door. Nah, just in case. Well, it's a green swirl. All right, I'm gonna make a break for it. Don't forget to give the rabbit's foot to Jeff, James. No, 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 no. Not now, not now. Come on, get out of there. Okay. Oh wait, I was supposed to heal. Oh god. Just go. Finish him, please. <sighs> Pee me hype. <sighs> that was a little scary. I forgot I was supposed to heal on turn two. It's 
slight time save. Alright, so use the exit mouse, teleport to Onnet, get another exit mouse. We need at least four bottle rockets and at least four skip sandwiches. What's up, Andy Andy? How you doing, man? Oh, God. Please don't hit the dinosaur. Please don't hit the dinosaur. No! Get out of there, dude. Get out of there. Get out of there. This is bad. Okay. That's fine, we're gonna lose a little time, but that encounter would have been really bad. That's fine. This is fine. Uh, the rabbit's foot doesn't move again until before I go to Magicent. So we leave it on, on Jeff, because the only things we have left to do before Magicent is the sprout and the mole. That was scary, man. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm late night right now, Andy Andy. Cause I'm on uh, graveyards. My bedtime isn't even for like another three hours. Although I probably won't stream much later than this run. Dad call, there it is. So actually, the dad call getting canceled out by when I died, I didn't lose as much time as I thought I did. I still lost time, but not that much because I'd missed a dad call and I won't get another one. And the text from the dad call would have been enough to, uh, to offset the, um, the game over screen a little bit it's mostly just that encounter so even if i had survived that encounter it wouldn't have lost much more time than i lost in already so that actually worked really really nice no there's a meme crescendo uh there's a meme in the in the community that you're supposed to use butts 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 when Daniel RGT got the uh, world record, he used the butts, 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 butts thing for the player's name. Because at the end of the game, it says the player's name. So it was like a meme. But you, it cost you like 10 seconds to do it. Dude, I am getting such bad RNG right now, but ha, they're all scared. I'm tempted to get the cup of life noodles. Nah. We're gonna we'll get the 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 horn of life before uh, we go in. But I was tempted to get that couple life noodles, man. I probably should have. See now, when I finish two sun manip, we won't have to do this entire segment. It'll already be done. So, however long this segment takes is how much time I'm losing not doing the manipulation, which is why I want to do it. I mean, yeah, there's a few inputs you have to do in a very specific movement. So it's not as fast, but it's not that much slower. Uh, bear? Mo? Bear? That's the way. Why you do that? So we're almost done with the game, Crescendo. We have this, one more place to visit. Then we go into a special place called Magicent. Uh -oh. Bear. Oof, that was close. Bear. Peepee, hype!
Can I exit mouse here, Sarium? Because I'm over leveled. Thank you, sir. Wait. Ah, I screwed up. Alright. Don't forget to give the rabbit's foot to Ness, James. Don't for... James? James? Don't forget to give Skip sandwiches and a rabbit's foot to Ness before you go into the cave, you dummy. Don't do it. If I do it, I'm not even gonna try. No, I'll try. No aggros. Nope. You stop it. Boob. Ran boob. Uh -oh. Okay, good. Nah, I don't even want to risk it. Nope. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just fight him. It's not so much that I'm scared of fighting him, it's that this is a time loss. They're usually not aggro, but there's a good portion of them that are. Like this guy. Like, why would you fight me, little sprout? You really think you have a chance? I probably could have ran. Oh no, you can't run from sprouts, can you? Okay, James, after the fight, switch the damn rabbit's foot out. Otherwise, you ruined four hours of your life. And don't multi-bottle rocket the damn thank you. Just for safety. I am JV. Thank you for the follow. Nice. Uh, power we don't even need. Okay, let's give the key to the tower to Paula. Ooh, we don't want that. We want this. We want to give the super bomb to Ness. Do we want the knight's pendant? Pendant protein drink. I don't want that. Give that to freaking Paula. Two, three. I'll just give it to Paula. I probably don't want more than that. That's good. And I still have the Franklin's badge. Good. Let's go. Rather play it safe here. Be a thoughtful, strong boy. <sighs> About a little over a half hour away from the end of the game if I don't screw up. Big PB. I actually probably could safety save. I 
I might as well. I'm so far ahead, dude. We're gonna hit our goal time easy. Let's just safety save just for the hell of it. You never know. So I equip the C pendant for... Oh, wait, is it the knight? The knight pendant's supposed to be on Ness. Oh, no! The knight pendant you use in the battle to keep him from killing you with flash, right? Well, let's just hope that doesn't happen. Oh, it does? Oh, okay. <laughs> then make sure the C pendant's on before we fight. I'll just put the C pendant on once I get to the C. So the knight pendant's more for protection against Gygus, I guess. This is back when Ness was an only child before RNG's sister was born. Eventually, I'd like to be able to skip the Krakens. I need to save state practice that. Um, there's a couple things I want to practice, like uh, Proto Skip, uh, Pump Skip, Skipping the Krakens, stuff like that. I also want to work on optimizing my uh, teleports. No, I know, I just, if I get the RNG, I need to be able to recognize it and say, okay, we can go for it now. Yeah, that's safety save. I don't even want to mess with it. It's a, t it's a 20 second time loss, it's fine. Yeah, well, kinda. He kinda is hallucinating right now. The power of the soundstone has caused him to hallucinate a little bit. Also, I want Flying Man. When do we get Flying Man in the speedrun, man? Make sure it's equipped, good. Out of the way, Ness. Get out of the way, Ness. Ness? I thought that was the bat. I'm an idiot. Alright, paralyze. Of course he called a damn UFO. Shit! Okay, I need to hit life up. I don't know what to do. Just keep running, I guess. There we go.
Paralyzed Omega? Okay. I'm just trying to save the uh, points. Damn! Bye bye! We're good. We're good. We'll, we'll life up before my nightmare. If I can get one of the Kraken skips. See, I'm going to fight this guy. Yeah, I don't think there's any way to get past him. Hit me. Damn you. There we go. No, don't breathe fire, jerk. If you're gonna do it, hit me at least. So yeah, I'll lose a little time on this split, but that's fine. Unless this fight goes really good and I'm able to skip both these guys. Where is he? Stay down there. No, no, no! That's okay. We we skipped one. Good lord, dude. Terrible fights. Look at that time just melting away. Okay. Now, if I'm lower than 300, I need to heal. I'm gonna heal next turn. That's fine, that's fine. I'm on the last page of my notes. Oh, baby. So we don't give the rabbit's foot to Jeff until right before Googie. What's up, Krim? What's up, bully? Uh, I got Manip through Ant. I don't know what I did different this time, but I got it through Ant. I dropped it after Ant, so I... There were some clutch moments. The strong fight was pretty clutch. Good lord, those level ups, so. You don't sleep? I 
Apparently Ness doesn't either. Alright, so... I think I'm good on skips. I still have a couple on Ness and I still have a couple on Pooh, so I'm gonna go for it. I know I still have Bottle Rockets. I know I have Super Bombs. Let me double check, actually, because I need how many Super Bombs for... for Pokey? I better double check. I think I have Super Bombs still. I'll double check to be sure. One on Paula, two on Pooh, three on Pooh. So I have four. I imagine if I ran out, I could just freeze. Where am I going? I don't even know where I'm going. Thought about trying to teleport past these guys, but they scare me. Ooh, shit, 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 shit. Probably could have made it up there. Almost there. We're there. Okay. That was a decent on it. No encounters. Might even save time. Pee hype! <laughs> Morning! I can't steal Yunos' thing. He'll get mad. He might not get mad. He probably doesn't care. <sighs> Thanks, man. Alright, before I actually do it, I'm gonna double check. One skip, two skips, two super bombs, four rockets, two skips, two super bombs. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, we're back to full circle with the lemon slice. <laughs> Alright, here we go. No turning back now. Let's go, baby. I'll get the horn of life.
So that heals me. So when I do my safety save, don't heal. So, Sarium, I have a question. If you get a uh, rockin' B first turn, is it best to use the Horn of Life on turn one? Or is it best to save it for turn two and hope you get outsped to revive Paula? And if you do use it to turn one, do you have to wait? Life up Alpha on Paula with Pooh having the cloak on. Okay. Okay, so I'm good then. I don't even need the, the horn. Uh, Bill and Ted 3. About 20 years too late. I mean, Keanu Reeves doesn't look too old, but Alex Winter is like 50 now. So I'm hoping that whatever they do is going to be like, okay, I don't know. Bill and Ted 2 wasn't even that good. Like, Bogus Journey was okay. It had a really good song at the end. Bogus Journey was okay. But... <clears throat> well, obviously, you no know, George Carlin, but... Everybody else, from what I understand. Yeah, I know. I know, it's so weird. Keanu's starting to look his age a little bit. He's starting to. Alright. We don't need to heal, because we just healed. Just save and let's go. We have four skips, four rockets, three bomb, four bombs. And tons of multi bottle rockets. I almost did it. Hope you get over your cold soon too, Dad. Oh, right off the bat. Okay, I want to re-equip re the rabbit's foot. What? Oh, this is bad. A squatter demon? I'm not worried about it yet. We're trying to green swirl all of these enemies. As many as we can. What? Ever. Alright, this is this guy. Don't you dare. Just for safety. Yeah, I'll just use it now. Damn it. I was trying to green scroll him. Don't steal my skip sandwiches, jerk. That's the bat right there. I want it. Do I want it bad enough to get it, though? No, I'm not going to get it. Let's go. Worth. Almost there. Mm. 
What? There was not two there. I'll wrap the heel. Run. Run like you've never ran before. That's not running. Come on. Get out of there. Okay, we're, we're good, we're good, we're good. <sighs> Just until my skip sandwich is gone. Okay. that to Ness. Give that to Ness. Whatever. Wait. Where's the night pendant? Oops. Nope. Thank you, sir. Where you're walking is his intestines, Crescendo. And that is uh, a uterus, I think. There's a lot of there's a lot of theories. There's a lot of fan theories. Some people just think he's an alien life form. There's a lot of theories. Come on, Rocket A, baby! One time! One time, Rocket A, come on. That is not Rocket A, and he outsped me. All good. Okay, we're gonna live. If he's paralyzed, then we're really good. All right, we're good. We're in there. We're good. We're good. <sighs> Woo! Okay. A little scary. God, this music is so good. It's sad that you only get to hear the first part of it. <sighs> so I don't want to lose Jeff or Pooh yet, but as long as I keep Ness and Paula alive, I'm good. Don't tell me this is an alien puddle. <laughs> I don't think the that does anything, so we'll just do that. Bye, Jeff. Oh. Well, bye, Pooh. Okay, good. I need to heal Ness. Ha! 
How do you like it? I'm gonna go offensive here. Good. Alright, we're in there. It's over. We got this. As long as I don't do any dumbs, we got it. I don't think we'll get... We're not going to get sub... Uh, sub 430. But we are going to PB by a lot. We are going to get our goal time. Probably should heal Paulo one time. Jerk. I probably don't even need to heal Paulo, but just in case he he knocks out Ness, I don't think he's going to. Yeah, I, I'm guessing... How long is it from first prayer? It's like eight minutes, seven minutes, something like that. Or is it... I don't remember how long it is. Somebody told me once. It's nice that Paul, uh, Jeff and Pooh are dead already. Yeah, I'll, I'll heal once with Ness, and then I hope he kills Ness. If you look at the shape of the background, it resembles a fetus, yeah. This was so trippy to me as a kid. I didn't I didn't really comprehend what it was as a kid. It just scared me. I was, I was 10, you know what I mean? Or I was 11 when this game came out. 95? Yeah, I was 11. I got it for my birthday the summer it came out. Alright, now I want him to kill Ness. So I'm going to attack, hoping he hits me. But at least if Ness lives, it's just Ness. But can I get one time for the uh, the real workhorse of this run? Can I get an F in chat for Jeff? My dude, he, he carried us the entire run. And I have the means to revive him, but I have to leave him dead. My dude, Jeff. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> Poor Jeff. He carried us the entire run. Oh man, I like the RNG. I mean, I'd rather have Ness alive if that's gonna happen. I'm mashing way too much. My first Earthbound run with any manipulation. It went pretty good. There's a couple scary moments. Like, we won't talk about uh, the first Kraken fight. We won't talk about Captain Strong. But there were some really good moments, too. I finally had a clean fire spring. A really good fire spring. See, Ness is helping. I don't think a Ness is going to die before the end of the run. That's fine. Random ladies in the country of Dalam. What is that? It's Pooh! No, Pooh is dead. 
You can pray all you want for Pooh, but he's dead. Pooh was relatively useless in the run. Pooh had his moments. He healed us in the uh, pyramid. He had his moments. I'm just gonna defend. It's fine. Of course, now it'll hit me for what would have been mortal damage or something. Yeah, see? I knew it. That's hilarious. I think that would have killed me if I wasn't defending. Oh well. My man Frank! My dude, my man Frank, don't underestimate him. Look how much he can hit a cosmic beam in the past. Hits him for 710 HP. My man. Kill me. Not Paula, just Ness. Rip. Bye, Ness. The only thing he could do to, to to possibly kill me at this point would be to freeze Paula over and over and over. Which would, like, somebody was saying would make me the unluckiest speedrunner in the history of this game. The I mean, the odds of me not finishing this run this time, you know, having to reload my save state and all that, or my save and all that, are uh, pretty damn remote. We got this, guys. All right, rip capture card. Sorry, guys. I did auto fight. No, oh, no. Rip time, dude. That's okay. I forgot. Ah, we lost like 20 seconds there. Whatever. It's fine. And then this is it. The prayer is time. Rack him! <sighs> yeah. Welp. I think we got our P our goal time. Thank you for the GG's unrelated pants, Sirium, Lilovir, Fiskbit. Thank you, Scuba Vince and Camit Tech. Thank you, Crescendo2020 and Indy Indy. Thank you, Eagleus and Loud Goat. Thank you for the GG's True Blue and Gruntiacious and Blazing AL420. Thank you, Shay Fit and Boop and Boom. Mr. Penguin and Resovaix, thank you all. I have to give shouts out, man. Did that auto fight cost me bopping new life? That's hilarious, dude. Oh well. <laughs> I'm not done yet. It's okay. I'm not sorry for the capture card, guys. Bid rate. I'm melting! I'm melting! Ah, ah, I'm melting! I think. I sure hope my capture card's tripping, otherwise I'd probably look really dumb. Ah, ah. <laughs> Thank you for the GG's, Crimson. What's a, a ghost nest? Do we want a ghost nest or do we want to just end the game? We met our goal time. 
Earthbound for the AVGN Trials is over. Just like the war against Gygus. So now it's time for me to make a real layoff of this game, isn't it? Good lord. Maybe I'll just use my Zelda layout. Um, I'm still going to run this game going forward, Fisk. But I am going to start the next game. And the next game in the AVGN Trials, we're not going to do a, draw a drawing for it. The next game in the Trials was a game that was selected before AGDQ. The reason I decided to do Earthbound immediately following AGDQ is that at AGDQ, Skate Man, Dr. Swellman, and D-Rock all sat down with me and helped me learn Boogie Percent. And I was like, you know what? I might as well just run the game and get it out of the way, right? Well, it turns out I really love this speedrun. <laughs> so I'm probably going to grind this down little by little. Um, I, I'm so close to getting the Manip that I kind of almost want to keep going before I start it. But... It's been something I've been putting off for a long time. I really need to get AVGN Adventures going. They've been space time by performing an alien abortion by walking into a cervix via an intestine road. <laughs> that is one of the theories, Crescendo. Thank you for the follow, Knight of Zero. I read that as Knight of Xerox at first. <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank you so much for the follow. Puppy high five incoming. So Crescendo's never seen this ending. So I'll give him the full ending. We'll do the full ending here. Hey, Cinder's Cup. JSR! You know you want it, we got it, come and get it. We win it, all you gotta do is hit it, baby. Ride, oh, die! Sorry. Pooh is always mad. <laughs> Look at him, he just throws presents. Look, here has some presents. Just throws them down from the sky, and now what is Jeff doing? Jeff, don't touch me! What are you doing? <laughs> M-D-V-H-F-D-I-U. I don't even know how to say that, but I will say thank you for the follow. As well for the follow, Blazing AL420, both of you guys. Thank you so much. Puppy high fives for everybody. presents okay so if you talk to everybody you get different dialogue a little late there mouse so you get letters from everybody Was scared now, KO I strong doing. What is this? This is a ruler, isn't it? Oh, it's a rust promoter. Ho oh, ho, we is breathe so good. So we'll read the letters. Dear R, everything's really going great here. I wish I could have gone with you on your adventure, even just part of the way. But instead, I'm sitting here waiting for you in winters. I want to see you again as soon as possible. I can't wait to see your cheerful face. I bet your glasses are dirty. If you come back, I'll clean them for you. Like I said, I'm waiting for you. For yours truly, Tony. P.S. Don't show this letter to anyone. <laughs> Thank you, Grunt. We'll go to the kids first. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine too. So are me. Me also. <laughs> me okay. <laughs> Please come back and play with us again at the Pulsar Preschool. So, a lot of the speedruns skip some of the stuff, but basically Paula works at the preschool with her parents, and when she goes kidnapped, all the kids are, are, are all freaking out. And then Mom... How are you? Since you left home on the journey, things have changed around here. I don't have as much laundry. We don't seem to eat... Whatever that is, as much as we used to. We defeated the Googie. I love how she, That's like, she's like... Oh, good for you, son. It was fun hanging out with you too, Jeff. It 
No, I would have let you die. And a nuts. Alright, so I'll show you guys a cool little thing if you've never seen this before. So, in, in summers, there's an area that you go in after Pooh gets there. And you have to go in and get a hieroglyph copy before you go to the pyramid. So, and the shop here has really good stuff, but it's all super overpriced. Thank you, Fappy. How you doing, man? Well, there's two enemies in this room. What is that? Eagleless with the resub. Five months in a row. GG on your PB, Mr. Cool Beard. Thank you, Julia. <laughs> Thank you very much, sir. Thank you for the GGs as well. Don't forget, though, the beard's going bye-bye. April 1st, if you use the charity uh, command in chat, uh, April 1st, I'll be doing a charity stream for Extra Life. And anybody who donates can put money towards what my beard will look like April 2nd. So if you want to see more information on that, use the charity hash, uh, exclamation point in chat. All right, so... There's an enemy to the right here. The only enemy left in the entire game. I should have let her die. So now we just let the time the, the counter count down. And then a really cool thing happens that I always thought as a kid, that, or not as a kid, as a, a younger adult, I should say, because I've been playing this game casually off and on, like, every couple of years since I was a kid. And I always thought this was a soft lock, but it is not. What exactly is it? Let's find out together. Oh, no! What? What is that? Welcome to Glitchland, where we are ghosts! <laughs> Look, she's standing on top of the- on top of the desk. So technically, time is still going for the Japanese RTA rules, but I don't know how that works with, uh, with Earthbound. I go by the, uh, speedrun.com rules, so it's all good, but now we're ghosts. We're just chilling. We're just chilling. We can go down here and talk to the bird. It's a minor bird. Wake up in the morning, fall in love, eat lunch, fall in love, and at night, fall in love again. That's my dream life. If you beat him, he just gives you experience points. You can level up and everything. So now, I can't remember what we're supposed to do to revive ourselves. Can you revive yourself? I don't even know if you can. Okay, there we go. He's, he's, you're supposed to kill him, I think. I think the game intends for you to kill him. So let's see, where is there cool stuff to check out? Is there anything cool in Winters or Dalam or Deep Darkness? Not really. There's really nothing else cool, cool. I mean, every, other, every one of the NPCs has a different message for the most part. 
like the ones that are important but chat what should I do should I take Paula home should I take Paula home let's take her home let's be a gentleman today let's be gentlemen today and take her home uh oh we got left right dog and left strong man Oh, you've forgotten it. Oh, Paula. Uh, I don't know, True Blue. I don't know, to be honest. One thing I really want to learn, I want to learn the any percent uh, glitch out of bounds stuff. I think that'd be kind of cool. So there's like different NPCs that talk about stuff. It's a really interesting ending. You could literally spend an hour just going around and talking to the different enemies and different people that have become all nice because the only enemy in the game is the one that killed us and I think he's still there. Alright, let's bring this run to a close, because I am starving. Mama! Oh, I'm sure that... They, they probably talk afterwards. I mean, that's uh, something I guess you could leave open for debate. I'm sure they probably talk afterwards. What do you guys think? Should I do a Z1 run? Am I that crazy? Should I do a Z1 run? Am I crazy? I might be crazy. I am hungry, but I kind of want to do a run. Hungry for level three? No, if I do a run, I'll probably do, uh... I don't know. Let me think about that for a minute. I don't know, I'm not tired. So let's go over the run real quick while the credits play. So first things first, let's get hype about that e that manip, dude. We only saved 13 minutes from the end of the ants until the end of the game. I'm sure there's probably more time there. Get to another run. Uh, but I'm very, very happy about the manip and how it went. Sub-15 ants, really, really good. It's 21 minutes strong. It could have been even better. Coming out of the giant step I accidentally wiggled and went left and that hit an RNG 3 trigger according to Arithium and that's why I lost the nip so I probably lost I lost to a minute and 20 seconds but I probably could have gained um, maybe a minute or two so I could have easily been 12 to 13 minutes ahead right there And then against Strong, so I didn't have enough money to buy a bunch of burgers. No problem, Crescendo. Thanks for hanging out, man. You're gonna miss the photo album, sir. Oh. Uh, I didn't have enough money to buy burgers, so I ran out of burgers because I had a really trolly cop. So, I went into the Strong fight on Yolo strats. I had enough to do two rockins, which would kill him, but if he hit me once, it was ripped. I was like, okay, well, let's just do it. And if I die, I'll do the manip again, and we'll nail it this time. Well, it turns out both my rockets hit, and he didn't, he didn't hit me, so I killed him. So we had a run. Um, I lost a lot of time in the early Tucson segments because um, 
of really bad RNG with encounters. It was just, it is what it is. It's fine. And then, uh, gained a lot of that back because my car painter fight was really good and my death abuse was really good. But then I had really bad RNG in, in uh, Milky Well Cave. Like, just really bad RNG in Winners. Um, the second proto called for help twice. So, I mean, I was just lucky I didn't die. But from that point forward, everything was pretty good. Um, I mean, I was near my gold on every split. Or I was gold on every split. Up until this split. I had a lot of uh, bad RNG in the desert. And uh, coming back from Belch's base. Which I expected. Because in my PB, I had literally zero encounters from Belch all the way through the desert. Nothing to dodge, nothing to despawn, none of that. So that was an expected time loss. It could have been worse. I'll take a 27 loss there. Um, Bull Cave went pretty good. I mean, obviously it was a gold split, but I didn't take too many bad encounters. Um, was never really in danger. It went really clean. Department Store is the only the, the real only snafu in this entire run was department store uh i went up to the second floor and i screwed up dodging the present and uh took an encounter and died but luckily it was right before dad call and all things considered that that ended up being not nearly as bad as it could have been obviously because i gained three minutes and 47 seconds um moonside went pretty good this did not. Um, I had to go to the hospital because Ness was paralyzed and Jeff was dead. So I had no way to revive either of them. So unfortunately I had to go to the hospital which cost me probably a minute. But my Monotoli was perfect. And I had a good shroom fight too. And then those were good segments. Kraken, I forgot to split. Kraken nearly wiped me. I finished that fight with one HP on Ness and nothing on Paula Jeff or Pooh. Uh, I had the mummy wrap and used it and she missed it. And then he hit me with the breathe fire and I was lucky to survive. But I had to go to the hospital after that too. And then I just had a really bad luck in the pyramid with spawns not despawning and catching encounters. I had one encounter against an asp and a general that nearly wiped my team. Dungeon Man though went pretty good. Uh, Deep Darkness went really good. Um, Starman base was okay. I had, I had too many encounters. I got too aggressive. But I didn't have any snafus, which was nice. Um, and then Electro Spectre and the rat splits were bad because I had to get a couple things and just had to despawn some, some encounters. I mean, it is what it is. But Thunder and Storm went good. And then, my god, that was a godlike fire spring. I didn't take a single bad encounter. Uh, the first two caves were empty when I got there. Uh, I think all the encounters I took were green swirls, with the exception of one of the f eternal flames or whatever, the soul eternal flames, whatever they're called. Um, the return to... to Mondo Mole Cave was good. Sprout was pretty decent. Magicent was ish. Um, I took one bad encounter where the loaded dice called for a UFO and I couldn't run. And then I fought two of the Krakens. I also safety saved. So in the future, I'm probably going to skip that safety save just to save some time. But I think that was a pretty decent split. Onet was godlike and then really good God Gagas fight, man. Like. That would have been a gold split if I had an auto fought. So, I'm very happy with this run. Easily the best run I've done, not just because it was a PB, but because I hit the Manip, I had lots of good segments. I am tickled pink with how this run went. Really, really happy with it. Just, I'm glad we got our goal. If nothing else, we got our goal. So now the question is, how much do I want to grind this game? Do I want that sub 4? The answer is yes. I do want sub 4. 
I just don't know how hard I'm gonna push for it right away. I want to finish learning the minute first. I need to practice a couple segments. Um, but I do think sub four is very, very possible. But I'm still just under an hour off world record. I don't know how much I want to grind to try to get close to that. That's gonna be difficult. Very, very, very difficult. But we'll see. You know, I think I am going to call it tonight, you guys. I was thinking about doing a Zelda run. I'm tired and I'm hungry. I've been practicing the minute before this run for a couple hours. Yeah, I think I'll call it. So if you were holding out for a Zelda run, I'm sorry, guys. I was going to do one. I just don't think it's a good idea. Tomorrow, though, I will do some Zelda before work. And uh, we'll try to get some uh, tournament practice in. Maybe some swordless runs or some, uh, hundo. But we did get our goal. So starting probably either tomorrow or Monday, I'm going to start looking at AVG and Adventures. I'm going to have to practice. I don't know, man. It's going to be, uh, a pain in the butt. AVG and Adventures is going to be really hard to learn because I can't use save states. And it's a tricky platformer, but we'll figure it out. We'll get it. But that is next in the trials. And this was easily the hardest trial I've had to work towards so far. But we got it. We crushed it. Because, I mean, we should have had 445 a long time ago. And, you know, I kept practicing and learning. And now I think I'm more than capable of a much better time than 445, obviously. But it's good to finally get that out of the way. Um, I will find somewhere to send you guys. But before I do... I want to just remind everybody, if you're around Monday, April 1st, I will be doing a charity stream, 12-hour stream from 5 p.m. Pacific Daylight to 5 a.m. Um, we'll be doing some cool stuff. Oh, what is that? The neighbors! Oh, mom's off. Spankity, spankity, spankity! The end? Question mark? Um, I'll be doing that stream, and if you guys are around, feel free to come by. It'll be a lot of fun. We're going to be doing a blind April Fool's race, uh, BS Zelda race, the Super Nintendo Pick'em Returns. Uh, I'll be doing a fun game for the Nintendo, uh, Super Russian Roulette, which you guys will be able to play with me. It'll be a lot of fun. Um, and, uh, a whole lot more. And if anybody donates... They'll have one of six options to choose from. And whatever one wins, I will be shaving my beard to that facial hairstyle the next day and rocking it for at least two weeks. So I could end up with some crazy facial hair. We'll see. But that is for Monday, April 1st, benefiting Extra Life and the uh, St. Rose Dominican Hospital in Henderson, Nevada. So it's a local hospital here for me. It'll be cool to help out. All the kids that need medical assistance. It'll be cool. And uh, it's my first real charity stream. So I'm pretty excited to do it. But yeah. Thanks uh, RC Drone for the massive host. Thank you so much Arithium and Cerium for your guys' help getting me through that run. Again, these guys are my guardian angels when I run Earthbound, man. They've been here every step of the way. Shouts out to Skate Man and D-Rock for helping me get started. Uh, Dr. Swellman. Uh, over at GDQ helped me out a lot too. Um, I really appreciate the help, everybody. We did it! Goal met! ABG and Adventures will be coming soon, and we'll be back on the trials, so it'll be a lot of fun. My goal for ABG and Adventures is world record. What? No, not world record. We, you, world record. Um, and it's very...